Hi everyone, it's Beck D from Beck D Transformation. So I just thought I'd lead us all in a little uh, meditation. And what I really wanted to share with you is the importance of grounding. So if you haven't heard of grounding, uh, it's about going barefoot, connecting with the earth. You can lie on the earth. So if you have the opportunity to do this meditation lying on the earth, it's really essentially good for you. Um, we do get energy from the earth and she does nourish us and revitalize us. And there's a great movie, a YouTube movie called Earthing. If you want to have a look at that, it's a full documentary and it journals the travel or the journey of a young woman who was diagnosed with toxic poisoning and she goes in search of healing herself. So it's well worth the watch and I would definitely recommend it. So if you've been following me for a while, you'll know I like to do an expansion exercise before I lead um, into a meditation. I feel like if we create space within our beings and our bodies that it contributes more to being in that capacity to manifest what we desire. So I'm going to take you on a short journey today just of healing the body really of manifesting healing for the body. Now we choose to heal ourselves. Uh, we may go to a healer. The healer is the channel. So when we're on the healer's treatment table, we can choose whether we heal a specific issue or whether we don't. It's all about letting go, surrendering and being willing to receive healing in the first place because our bodies have the capacity and the desire to heal themselves. So it's all up to us in the end. So just close your eyes or sit sit or lie down wherever you are whatever's more comfortable for you and let's just take some deep breaths in through the nose out through the mouth and try and fill your belly try and take that breath right into your belly so that it's deeply relaxing and you're letting go as you go just letting go as you go And now just becoming aware of your body in the seat. Your body and its beautiful energy in the seat. And let's just now move out our energies out of the body, past our seats, past our bed, past the earth where we may be lying at this point. And just becoming aware of the energies around us, the space around us, and just really starting to experience some space and we're going to expand out and if you haven't done this before it's really about letting go of the confines so quantum physics tells us that we're just energy we're not solid like we are led to believe we see things as solid because that's how our brain functions and processes however we are just energy so let's just expand out our energy and expand out our energy and expand out our energy and just as a visualization I'd ask you to expand out now into the room you might be in or if you're on the earth in your garden just expand out to your garden just imagine your body getting bigger and lighter as you go bigger and lighter and just if you can at all, if you've got any science background whatsoever, you did high school science and you had photos of, of protons, electrons, neutrons all circulating around each other, I want, would like to ask you to imagine that space. Imagine that space in your body. Imagine the molecules in your body as you do this expansion exercise and expanding out and expanding out and allowing that energy to become aware of that energy past your yard let's go into your suburb and all the while just letting go of the heaviness any density any kind of aches or pains that might be with you taking your mind to the space that you're feeling the space between the molecules and going out to the country you might be in right now going out to the boundaries of the country and then going out past the oceans, past the oceans. For me, I'm in Queensland, Australia, the beautiful Sunshine Coast. 
So right now I'm feeling and seeing and experiencing going out across the oceans, across to New Zealand, New Guinea, Japan, the beautiful Polynesian islands. I'm imagining expanding out. So for you, whatever continent you might be on, just imagine expanding out past your country, past the landmass, into the oceans and past there. And then just have a, a, an idea of the continents around you, of the little islands that might be around you. How about the other countries that might be around you? And just imagine just feeling lighter and lighter, allowing yourself to let go of gravity, let go of the heaviness of this planet. And just allow yourself now to become the energy, become the space above the planet. Going into space. There is no gravity on the moon, we're told. So just imagine being as light as that. Imagine those astronauts that were bouncing around the moon. They weren't being held in place. In fact, they had to put weights in their boots. So imagine just floating now, just going and floating now. You're floating in space. There are no boundaries. Nothing is holding you down. Nothing is dense. Everything is space. Allow yourself to be that space. And just feel the peace. The peace in this place. The peace that comes with space when we become the energy of who we truly be, who we truly are. And the peace that that brings and the space that that brings. So now just while you're in this beautiful space, I want you to just bring to mind your body, your beautiful body, this resilient, gorgeous body that you've you're traveling in it's the vehicle the body is our vehicle so just like any car when we don't service our vehicle when we don't look after our vehicle when we don't give it the right inputs vehicles need oil they need water they need, or coolant they need to be cleaned they need to main, be maintained they need the care of a good mechanic so let's just think of our bodies in this way Let's send some love to our bodies. Just send some love to the beautiful cells in your body, to your beautiful body itself. Thank it for being here. Thank it for carrying you through life this far. Now just becoming aware where you have no gravity, that you're, you are just energy. And just know that our thoughts are energy too. Our thoughts create a vibration. So all energy, Disease, illness is the physical manifestation of our vibration. When we speak badly to our bodies, when we speak badly to ourselves, when we're detrimental, when we put ourselves down, when we talk about our bodies in a non loving way. So, right now, I want you to just reach in and just really feel start to feel some love for your body some compassion for your body for the the fact that it has to walk this dense planet it has to carry us through this dense planet it has to put up with the the stress and the thought patterns and all the programming and and it does a marvelous job so just in this time in this space i'd really invite you to take some time to to give your body some nourishing thoughts, some gratitude. Thank your body. Thank your body for how far it's brought you already, that it's still hanging in here with you on this dense planet with you. And just think of the attributes of your body. Your body might be particularly strong, which I now invite you to thank your body for its strength. Your body might be really beautiful, I just want you to invite you to thank your body for being really beautiful. Your body may be really healthy and vibrant. So thank your body for being healthy and vibrant. Your body might be riddled of pain, but it's still moving you around. It's still taking you places. It's still putting one foot in 
front of the other. So please, I invite you to thank your body for continuing despite the pain. So now in this place, I just invite you to close your eyes, to be nice and relaxed, to spend some time just tuning in now, just tuning in, just really listening to your body. And is it communicating to you? Pain is the body's way of communicating to us, telling us something's out of balance. So I want you to just center in on that pain or that discomfort that you might be feeling. And ask your body, body, what is it that I'm not listening to? Body, what is it that you're attempting to tell me? Body, what's the gift in this pain? Body, what is it that you wish me to pay attention to? And just take some time. I'm going to be quiet for a moment. Just please take this time to really listen in. Really listen in to your body. Really get the message of what your body is attempting to tell you, attempting to communicate to you through this pain, through this discomfort, through this tightness, through this rigidity. Sometimes we're stiff, we're sore, sometimes it's burning, sometimes it's aching, sometimes it's stabbing pain, sometimes it's tight and pinching. Sometimes it's inflexibility in that we can't outstretch, we can't lift up, we can't touch behind us, whatever it might be for you. Just really taking that time now to tap into that. And allow yourself to receive the message. Receive the message of what your body is trying to tell you right now. It's a gift. If you can look at it this way, it's a gift. So now that you're receiving this information, this communication openly, I want to take you through a little visualization where you're just imagining all of your blood cells all of your white cells, which are like the soldiers of the body, the white cells are the soldiers of the body, and they go to battle for us. They go to battle, they get rid of toxins, they get rid of infection, the inflammation, they fight inflammation, they take away residue that doesn't belong in the body. So just imagine all of your blood cells just coming alive. If you're lying on the earth especially, just taking in that vibration of the earth, that energy of the earth and allowing it to feed every cell in your body. If you're out in the sun, taking in the sun's rays and allowing the sun to feed every cell of your body through your skin, the largest organ of the body. These energies are freely available to us, freely available and they're so nourishing. If you live by the beach, you know the power of moving water. If you live by a river or a waterfall, get yourself down there around that as much as you possibly can. It'll boost your uh, negative ions. It will even up the negative and positive ions. It's great for a low mood. It picks up your mood, it lifts your mood. And remember, we only need 10 minutes in the sun to get our vitamin D for the day. So coming back to that visualization of taking nourishment into the cells, taking nourishment from your surroundings. For me, I've got this beautiful pender tree over me. I'm taking energy from this pender tree, from this lemon myrtle beside me that I've kept in a pot because they grow huge and I don't want them to. So just taking in the energy. There is energy all around us. We can replenish ourselves, replenish our bodies with energy. So I really want you to get this. Energy is free and it can heal you if you allow it to, if you choose that. So taking in that energy into your body, into your being. I can feel all of my cells tingling. 
So allow yourself to absorb this energy. Allow yourselves to tingle. And just soak it up. Soak up this energy. Allow those blood cells, those beautiful red blood cells to soak up that energy, be revitalized for them to reproduce healthy, beautiful, vibrant red blood cells. Healthy, beautiful, vibrant cells. Allow those white cells to be on overdrive with the amount of energy you're feeding it right now from wherever you are. You can get energy from computers, from phones, from tablets, from light. There is energy all around us. We can take energy from the environment. It's our gift and it's free. It costs nothing. So I really want to lead you on this energy exchange at the moment and really just help you to tap in and feel and resonate with the energy all around you and how you can take this into your body, take it into your body to feed your cells, your white cells, which are like the soldiers of the body. They help our immune system. They build up our immune system. The red cells that carry oxygen all around the body, the veins, the arteries. The arteries take oxygenated blood from the lungs to the rest of the body. The veins carry deoxygenated blood back to the lungs blessed are we we never have to think about any of this we never have to think about taking a breath it just all happens automatically it all happens the body is amazing it's an amazing machine there is no other machine like it in this entire existence there is nothing man-made that surpasses the human body it's magnificent so please just take this time to revel in the magic of your body, the magic of your body. Allow yourself to feel this beautiful energy that's all around you, contributing to you, giving you life and vibrance and energy, replenishing your cells. Imagine yourselves reproducing at a rapid rate. Healthy cells, energized cells that can keep you well, that can take you on a journey of healing if you're unwell. So taking this energy into your body and now just allow that energy to travel to those spots, those stiff spots, shoulders, elbows, knees, joints, ankles, feet, back, wherever it may be, wherever it may be, allow that energy to flow to those areas and nourish those areas, enliven those areas. And now just sit for a moment and just enjoy this expansive feeling. Just enjoy it for a moment. And you can pause it right here if you just want to sit here for longer in this moment. Just pause this video right here. Sit in this space of expanded energy, absorbing energy in your environment and really nourishing your body. And once you've done that, we're just going to reverse the process to come back into our bodies, our bodies proper, the physical bodies, the vehicles we drive around in on this planet. So we're just going to come back from there now. So just as we went out expanding our energies, we're going to basically contract back we're going to bring ourselves back energetically bring ourselves back from space bring ourselves back and while we're coming back while we're imagining traveling traveling back through the layers of space back past the moon back to the surface of the earth just attempt to keep this expansion with you carry and bring this expansion with you coming back across the earth across the um, continents across the ocean coming back across the ocean into your body into your body into your body back across your own country 
back across your own state, back across your own suburb. And if you're like me, if I'm, I'm just buzzing with energy right now and I'm not really desiring to come back. However, my body feels amazing. So just coming back and coming back and coming back. Back into your body. Just allow yourself to settle back in your body. You may become aware of the new space within you, the new space within you, the new vibration within you. And there we have, that's just a, a quick expansion exercise. And just a tool for you to use today that may help you just tap into those energies around you to feed and nourish your body, to replenish your body, to revitalize your body, to feed your cells, to oxygenate your cells. And to give you some space and some some uh, peace in your body. And I hope that the pain is now diminished. For me, I'm just tingling all over. I feel like my vibration is fairly high right now. So I thank you for this time. Thank you for tuning in. And I wish you the best of days, the best of weeks and the best of years. Please do tune in again to my YouTube channel, Beck D Kahuna Massage. You can follow me on Facebook, Beck D Transformation. And I'm on parlor now, Beck D Transformation. And I thank you for your time. I wish you a glorious day. And I'll catch up with you next time. If you enjoyed this video, please do leave a comment below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you. Have a great day.